Hey YouTube buddies, what's up? Welcome back to your favorite channel, PhDNC. In this video, let me show you some of the journals which are having fast review process wherein you can get your first decision whether accepted or rejected or whether your manuscript requires minor revision or major revision. The review process is fast which takes less than one or maximum two months. So in this video I will show you how to publish fast in elsewhere journals. So please do watch the video till the end and if you are new to the channel a gentle reminder that please do hit the subscribe button so that you can get connected for upcoming videos so before moving on to the journal list let me remind you that content in the video is extracted by elsewhere journal finding tool wherein in order to get your review process faster you need to follow these five guidelines these journals are reported to provide rapid review based on your research data what you submit and you need to follow authors guidelines uh, read the aims and scope of the journal before submitting and please do not forget to format according to the journal needs so if you have any further clarification you can easily contact us on phdns at gmail.com so let us jump on to the video straight away so first journal in the list is innovative food science and emerging technologies it is an official scientific journal of european federation of food science and technology it has a good impact factor of 4.0 and here you can see the time to first decision is 2.2 weeks which means less than one month so you can see the aims and scope along with the recently published articles most downloaded articles you can see the impact factor and you can see the announcement call for publications etc so this journal is abstract tracking or indexing in scopus let us see whether this journal is capable of yes this journal is abstracting in scopus which is very good and if before uh, submitting your paper please do read authors guidelines so moving on to the next journal in the list uh, material science and engineering a it is a structural materials properties microstructure and processing journal and it has an impact factor of 4 and you can see the aims and scope of the journal you can read the complete aims and scope the journal invites or is expecting articles related to material science you can see here the recently published articles most downloaded articles let us see the abstracting and indexing of this journal and if your research is related to material science then please do consider uh, this research this journal for your uh, publication so here you can find the databases and you can see the scopus it is also indexed by scopus so moving on to the next journal in the list is materials characterization materials characterization is an international journal on material structure and behavior and you can see it has a very good impact factor of 3.2 the time to first decision is 2.2 weeks which is less than one month and they are accepting articles related to structure and behavior of materials you can see the most downloaded articles here 
and let us see the abstracting and indexing of this journal so if you are working on material science then you can target this journal here you can see it is indexed by Sci and Scopus both which is very good for a, a research paper so moving on to the next journal is biosensor and bioelectronics it is having a very high impact factor of 9.5 and you can see the most downloaded articles it is it is mainly devoted towards development and application of biosensors and bioelectronics which is related to research and design of sensing material so you can check the author's guidelines before submitting to this high impact factor journal let us see the abstracting and indexing pattern of uh, this journal and here you can see it is indexed in various databases and you can find Sci and Scopus so it is a very good high impact factor journal please do read author's guidelines before submitting your uh, research to this journal so next in the list is chemical engineering journal it is an international journal of research and development and which has a high impact factor of 8.3 you can see the time for first decision is 2.7 week which means less than a month and it is accepting articles related to chemical reaction engineering environmental chemical engineering material synthesis and processing so you can see read the complete authors guidelines and let us see the abstracting and indexing of uh, this journal so it has a very good indexing pattern and you can see it is indexed in scopus so our aim is to provide you the journal list with rapid review process and also having an indexing in scopus so next in the list is chemical engineering and bio sorry chemical engineering and processing process intensification so it has an impact factor of 3.0 and you can see its first decision is within 3.9 weeks the decision of these journals depend upon your type of article what you are submitting and the content of your research data so it is an average calculated uh, review process time so moving on to the aims and scope you can read the aims and scope and they have a variety of aims and scope chemical engineering material science engineering fluid mechanics environmental engineering biotechnology engineering energy technology so it is a multidisciplinary journal so it has a good impact factor let us see the indexing pattern of this journal and if you are working on these related areas then you can uh, consider this journal for targeting your upcoming research manuscript so it is indexed in sci as well as scopus which is really good for your upcoming publication moving on to the next journal in the list uh, materials today communications so you can see the complete aim and scope of this journal and it is having a decent impact factor of 1.8 so you can see the most downloaded articles recent articles etc let us see the abstracting and indexing of this journal so if you are research is related to materials chemistry or related to materials then you can consider targeting this journal so it has a good impact factor of 1.8 as its first impact factor and let us see 
the indexing pattern of this journal I'm sorry to have this inconvenience due to my internet problem let us jump on to the uh, next journal in the list so you can see the next journal in the list is computational and theoretical chemistry and it has a good impact factor of uh, 1.3 and you can read the aims and scope of this journal and before submitting please do read author's guidelines and it has an impact factor of 1.3 so let us see the indexing pattern of this journal so according to the title we can see it is related to chemistry computational the theoretical chemistry so if you are working on this related aspect you can target this journal it has abstracting in scopus so which is very good for your research uh, manuscript please check author's guideline before submitting your paper so moving on to the next journal in the list is micron the international research and review journal for microscopy if you are working on microscopy micro analysis and reports on optical and electronic beam microscopy etc then you can target this journal you can see the most downloaded articles recent articles let us see the indexing pattern and before moving on to the indexing pattern let us see the impact factor it has a decent impact factor of 1.5 which is very good for your research if you are having um, good uh, research data then you can check your research uh, and target to this journal so let us see the abstracting and indexing pattern of this journal it is indexed in scopus and sci cite like abstracting databases so before targeting this journal you can uh, read the author's guidelines moving on to the next journal talanta the international journal of pure and applied analytical chemistry so it has a good impact factor of 1.9 and you can read the complete aims and scope here and let us see the abstracting and indexing of this journal it is indexed in the above science sci and scopus which is really good if you are working on your research related to let us see the aims and let us glance at the aims and scope of this journal which is related to analytical chemistry if your research is related to analytical chemistry then you can consider targeting this journal so moving on to the next is enzyme and microbial technology it is having an impact factor of 3.5 you can see the time to first decision is 3.1 week which means less than a month so let us see the aims and scope it's a peer-reviewed journal publishing original research and reviews of biotechnological significance and novelty on the basic and applied aspects of science technology of processes so you can see the aims and scope here and moving on to the indexing pattern you can see let us see what is what are the databases where this journal is indexed so you can see it is indexed in various databases which has sci and or you can also find pubmed and scopus which is really good so moving on to the next journal in the list research in microbiology it is having an impact factor of 2.6 and the aims and scope of this journal includes research related to microbiology 
applied and basic microbiology you can see the aims and scope let us move on to the indexing pattern of this journal if your research is related to microbiology or its applied sciences then you can target this journal so it is abstracting and having indexing in pubmed which is really good and also you can find the scopus so moving on to the next journal in the list international journal of biological macromolecules it is having a good impact factor of 4.7 with the rapid review process which is done within 2.9 weeks within a month and it has a wide range of aims and scope from natural macromolecules protein structure properties of protein glycoproteins biological polyacids nucleic acids etc if your research work is related to on these aspects then please do consider reading the aims and scope before targeting this journal let us see the abstracting and indexing pattern of this journal so if you are working on macromolecules which which are origin of which has a biological origin then you can easily target this journal with good impact factor and high really rapid review process so let me once again check the abstracting pattern of this journal as the internet is really slow today so i'm extremely sorry so you can see the abstracting in repeated databases like pubmed scopus etc so before uh, targeting this uh, you have a research in this journal please do read author's guidelines so moving on to the next journal in the list is collide and interface science communication which is having an impact factor of 1.8 which is really good as of now which will increase in future and you can see the aims and scope of this journal and uh, let us see the indexing pattern of this journal so it is indexed in psi and scopus which is really good so if you are working on the research related to collide science then try to read the author's guideline before submitting your research last but not the least in the list is journal of photochemistry and photobiology b so it has an impact factor of 4.0 and it, the aims and scope you can see bioluminescence chronobiology dna repair environmental photobiology nanotechnology in photobiology etc you can see the different uh, aims and scope and you can see the most downloaded articles recent articles on this web page let us see the abstracting and indexing of this journal so if your research is related to photobiology then i think this is the best journal where you can communicate so it is indexed in pubmed and yes corpus sci so before targeting this journal please do consider to read guide for authors and submit your research data so with this let me conclude my video and remind you to please hit the subscribe button and share this video among your friends and please do stay connected for upcoming videos if you have any queries please do contact us on phdns@gmail.com and please do comment on this video so that we can improve our quality in future uh, upcoming videos with this during this lockdown period i wish you a stay uh, safe stay and so that you can upgrade your scientific knowledge by watching our videos thank you wish you good luck bye